but it's in great condition. And I love the green, I love the color. Is that not gorgeous? And... Hey guys, my name is Missy, and I'm a full-time thrifter, picker, or better yet, treasure hunter. I love finding things that catch my eye and bringing them back to life. You can find me picking garage shells, thrift shops, flea markets, auctions, and yes, even curbs. So come join me on this adventure. Let's do some picking. Hey guys, it's Missy with Junk To Be Loved. I am back with another haul video for you guys today. Um, this is a haul from the previous picking video that you've seen. It's been about four days ago since I posted it. Um, but this is a haul from Bibles and the Well and Pella. So I will show you everything that I got. I can't remember if I stuck the receipt in here. I don't know where the receipt is, so. Oh, right here. I spent a total of $25 exactly. So not bad at all. And the first thing that I picked up, well, maybe if I can get to it. Everything's still packed in this box. Um, was this. Now this is a beautiful um, vintage uh, for picture frame, obviously, but it tilts, it swings, and it's got the wood base. It's awesome, and it was $5, and this is actually already sold. I had someone message me about it already, so this will be going out in the mail this week. And I love it. I like the wood detail on there. It's very pretty, the wood detail. It is missing a little bit of paint, you know, but that just gives it character to me anyways. I like it. So I got that. And then I got this and I thought this was adorable. It makes me so angry when they put the stickers on the book. So I'm going to have to get take that off carefully. But look at it. It's like a prairie mantis or something. I love it. I just thought it was cool. I think this will be a nice display piece once I get that stupid sticker off of there. I love it. And it is from 1941. Insects and Friends and Enemies. Cool. So, I thought it was neat. And then the, here's the back. I thought that was pretty cool, and that was $2. Then I spent, <clears throat> or then I got these, and aren't these adorable? I think they're so cute. The frames aren't old, but somebody made them. They're, you know, like the cross stitch or needle point or embroidery. Embroidery, I mean, that's what they are, embroidered pictures. And they're cute. I really like them. They're colorful, colorful and would look good filling up a little spot on your wall. And they were a dollar a piece. Then I got this and this was a dollar. And now I, they have them, um, whatever, you know, tagged together. So, oh, so I couldn't open them and see what they look like. So we are going to do that together now. Picks. Okay, here's the first one. Oh, these are adorable. They're like little hankies. Oh, isn't that so cute? I think it's adorable. So cute. So there's that one. There was three. I got three for a dollar. And then there's that one. And then there's this one. Oh my gosh, so cute. 
They're so cute. They're stinking adorable. They need washed, but I just think they're so cute. I like them. So I got those three for a dollar. Then I got a couple brooches. I got this one for three dollars. I like it. I like the flower brooches. And then this one for $2.50. It's a big flower. And then this one for $2.50. I like the stone in that one. So I picked up those three. And I got this. And I love this. It is a mirrored vanity tray with the metal around the base. It's so pretty. You can see my reflection of my messy house, my TV and everything. It's not really messy, but cluttered. And I like it. I love the detail. And there's the back, just a black back. And I think it's pretty. And it was $3. So I got that. Then I got these. And these were a dollar a piece, I think. And there was two of them. They're Corel plates. And these I'm keeping. These are for us to use at home because I'm trying to get the pretty Corel patterns that I like with the flowers and the colorful ones. So I got these and they were a dollar a piece like I said. But I like that pattern with the flowers and then there's their Corel. And the last things I picked up there and I picked these up because I thought they might have been the glassy babies, but they're not the glassy babies. But they're still really, really pretty, right? I think they're gorgeous and they're thick. They're thick glass. And I just think they're really pretty. I don't know if they're candle holders. I'm assuming they're candle holders, but I don't know because they're so thick. but no markings and they were $2 a piece. So that was my haul from Bibles. Yep, I didn't get anything else. That was my haul. So I spent $25 total there. Then I went to the well and got, I spent, here, let me see what I spend at the well. $14.16. And $14.16. And the first thing that I found that I picked up was this. Now this is, I'll take it, they have it wrapped in plastic. This is a Viking glass candle holder. And I know this because I have an orange one and I sold a blue one. But this is Viking glass. It's very heavy. It's got the tea. They somebody put a tea light in there. But it's in great condition. And I love the green. I love the color. Is that not gorgeous? And I paid $2.28 for that. And I like it. Then I got this. And it is a 75 interlocking large pieces round puzzle, which I haven't opened it up yet to take all the pieces out to see if they're all there. I'm hoping, I'm hoping that they are, 
but I guess I will count them and see, but this was only $1.58. And it's a vintage puzzle, and I like it. And this one is um, Pied Piper. Let's see who that one is. And then I got another one. And this one is Rumpelstiltskin. So these are fun. And then, again, $1.58. So I thought these were a lot of fun. Then I got this and I love old books. I'm just so attracted to old books. I have a, a big collection myself. Ooh, something got on it. I don't know what got on this book. I have no idea, but okay. So this it's, isn't that cute? I thought this would be cute for like Halloween, you know, or fall decor with the scarecrow, but it has a really cute, um, really cute things. Oh, look at the camel. And this is from 1969. Night. Oh, look at the spring. This is from 1969. Copyright. And then it's just got all these little short stories in there. It's so cute. Oh, look at these birds. I love these. My hands are sticky now. Look at those birds. I love the graphics, the illustrations on there. So cute, right? And there's another one. Those are so cute. Oh, look at the little cars and the bunnies. Adorable. So that one was two, and it's thick. It's a thick hardback. And it was $2.18. Um, there is 235 pages. No, 237 pages. Excuse me. 237 pages. So that is cool. Then I got this. How adorable. I thought this would be so cute. Look at the witch on there. So I thought this would be cute for like a Halloween display. You know, I mean, I guess, and it's got the pumpkin, but it's got the 4th of July and it's got the heart. I mean, you could really use it for any, any holiday, I guess. And then on the back, look, it's got a Christmas tree. That's so funny. So Humpty Dumpty's holiday stories. How fun. And this one is from 1973. 1973. It's got some cute illustrations in there too. I like it. Humpty Dumpty's Holiday Stories. And this one's 58 cents. 58 cents. And then the last thing that I got there was this little book. Oh, the donkey who wanted to be wise. How cute. And this one was $1.18. But it's got some cute, cute old illustrations in it. This one's from 1961. But just look at the inside cover. So stinking cute. I absolutely love it. It's It's got really, really, really cute illustrations in there. So, I like this one. And $1.18. So, not bad at all. I love it. 
Okay, guys, that was my haul. Like I said there, I only spent $14.16 on all that stuff. So, um, as always, if you're interested in anything I find, feel free to send me a message. My email is junktobeloved at gmail.com. All lowercase letters. The link is in the description below. And I also list on eBay and Facebook Marketplace. So those links will be in the description below as well. And then I do a lot of live sales. I do two live sales a week. I do Mondays afternoons at 3 p.m. Central Time and then Tuesday evenings at 7 p.m. Central Time. So I will be having one this evening. Yay! Um, so don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Hit that bell button so you're notified every time I post a new video and when I'm going to be having my live sales. And until next time, keep smiling and happy picking. Bye guys! Hey guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. Please remember to like, share, and subscribe. And until next time, keep smiling and happy picking.